Hey guys, I'm Ron here at Atlas Survival Shelters. You guys want to see my $10,000 shelter? Well, this is the NATO safe. And the NATO safe is designed to be like a tornado shelter safe room that you could incorporate into the body of a house. Or if you have an existing house, you could slide it into the garage. So today, I'm going to build one, deliver it, and go install it. So I hope you enjoy my video. got a five by seven NATO safe, detailed out, stainless handle on the outside, nice stainless on the inside, so it's two-toned. We got a folding bed inside, painted inside and out after it was sandblasted. It bolts on the floor, so you got plenty of places to put your bolt for your safe room or tornado shelter, whatever you want to call it. It's got lifting eyes, but it won't get used in this case. Um, but that's it. That's the uh, NATO safe from Atlas Survival Shelters. Now this one does not have the little Israeli made air system inside it um, because he's not gonna use it for that. This is strictly a safe room and tornado shelter in case he has to run in something. And of course it has the emergency porthole. So you can open it from the inside. And uh, scream for help or flag for help. That's good. You, that's good. You gotta get it in the middle of the trailer. That's good right there. All right. So we're delivering a NATO safe that's going to be framed into this house right here. So it's going to have a secret. Where is it going to go? Like this little room right here? Yeah. Okay. So that'll be a secret room. All right. So if you guys are gutting a house or building a new house, you can frame me in a NATO safe so you don't hit by, get hit by the bullets or the tornadoes. You gonna go in front or backwards? All righty. Now, when did you order this? Three days ago. <laughs> you got it. How do you like that delivery service? It couldn't get better than that. So the unit slides in here. That gives me about two foot here, which will be a false wall with an entry that you can't see. It'll All right. Be like a bookcase. You won't even notice it. All right, so that'll be your tornado shelter safe room. Correct. The best time to do this is when you build your new house. Ain't gonna be a new house. This will be a new house. Yeah, I know. But for the people watching this video, when they build their new house, they need to put that inside the new house so it's hidden in the wall. Otherwise, if they remodel, they have to go through all this extra work. Yeah. Well, when the bullets start flying. <laughs> Híjole. Hoy. Ven. Literally tore a wall out the side of this house to get it in. Oh, look. 
corner and lift your knives, which is part of my trademark. They sure come in handy. To the caveman techniques, we're gonna put pipes down and roll this sucker in the house. <laughs> Better than getting jacked around by family, see? <laughs> I know you know who that is. Oh, I'll show you their address. They're local. Oh. All right, it's moving. Pipes underneath it on the back. Come in a little bit more though. Let me get him on top of that pipe. Hey Brandon, go ahead and bring it up a little. Camarata on his YouTube channel puts stuff together, puts it around with equipment. Except he gets a half million views a day. I don't. Now you can raise it up that pry bar, or put up some blocks, push down on the pry bar, you raise it up enough to get the dollies out. Do the old leverage thing. What about here? Oh, no, 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 all right, he's got to push it with the uh, skid steer. You got to do one side at a time or oh, both sides? Let's see. Okay, he's got it in place. We had to put on our proudly made in Texas sticker and of course the Atlas sticker. So you got the gas tight door, you open it up. And inside this, he has a set of folding beds. Go ahead and put your beds up. Just push them up. Oh, they just push up? Yeah, see that, isn't that nice? And on the inside, okay. you got an emergency porthole. Go ahead and open that up. You turn it a couple times. And then you can look out and scream for help or whatever you got to do. So you were going to use these guys. What happened? Uh, let's see. Phone tag 20 times. Her son was going to contact me. And then we had a date to show up. He didn't show up. Then he called me and says, well, I wasn't, conf I was going to confirm with you first. I said, dude, I gave you a date and a time. And then he didn't call. I called you. You said, I got one. It'll be there in three days. It's here in three days. I told him your business no longer needed. <laughs> and that's a cut. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hey, if you're not a subscriber, make sure you like and subscribe, share this video if you found it interesting and you want to see more of my shelter videos. But guys, as always, I love you. I'll see you on the next video.